Hey Cobra Kai fans, so Johnny still hasn't met Terry Silver or Mike Barnes, but I'm really intrigued in the way that Johnny is going to meet Terry Silver in Cobra Kai Season 4. In the flashbacks, we know that Terry Silver said he owes it to Kreese, so we're going to see him next season. It's been heavily teased and at the end of Season 3, we know that Kreese is probably calling Silver other than anyone else and he doesn't actually know Terry Silver. He's never met him and didn't know he was associated with Cobra Kai. What is your relationship to this... Terry Silver. Ma'am, I have no idea who that even is. Johnny has no idea that Terry Silver existed, so he's going to have a very big surprise when he finally meets him in the next season. These flashbacks were just a hint of what's to come in season 4. We're going to see Terry Silver back, but we're going to see him maybe worse than he was in Cry Kid 3, or maybe something has happened to him that's humbled him. Because after those events, Cobra Kai had ceased to exist, and a lot of bad things happened. And then of course, Johnny brought them back in season 1. Terry could easily meet Johnny and deceive him, just like he did with Daniel. And in a similar way, he could could deceive Johnny because Johnny has never met Terry and even knew what he looked like and he confirmed this because he said he didn't know who Terry Silver or Mike Barnes were when the karate committee said they were banned along with Cobra Kai at the tournament. However, Daniel knows Terry Silver very well and of course because they're teaming up in season 4 they are going to have a stronger relationship. So I believe that Johnny is going to be told by Daniel about Terry Silver and that he used to be in Cobra Kai and he understands what it's like to strike first because I don't think Daniel has ever told Johnny that he was in Cobra Kai. So this is going to be an interesting development for their relationship as well. And Terry Silver is actually going to make their relationship grow stronger, which is actually interesting. They could essentially use Terry Silver's character as an anchor to bring Johnny and Daniel even more closer because Daniel can tell Johnny about Terry Silver and his evil, insane ways. And that if you thought Kreese was bad, then wait till you meet his psychotic old friend who was one of the biggest deceivers. But if they want to play this arc for longer into the season, they have to introduce Terry to Johnny before Daniel sees him again and that would mean that when Daniel finds out he would then tell Johnny that this guy is more insane and more mad than even you could imagine that Kreese was. We know that Terry Silver was a businessman and he could easily be introduced as a business partner to Tom Cole or even offer Tom Cole some revenge on Daniel which would obviously then tie in Johnny and Daniel together because them two would realize that not only that this karate tournament it means to get rid of Kreese but his best friend has come back to even ruin him and his business. And Terry was obviously a very dodgy businessman with Dynatox and he could easily try and manipulate Tom Cole into really hurting Daniel as he did with Kreese and Cry Kid 3. I think Terry is going to deceive Johnny and try and overthrow him in his dojo because he would really want to help Kreese, especially now the fact that Kreese has got Cobra Kai back on his own and that he didn't actually need Terry's help this time. So he's probably going to help knowing the fact that Kreese did this by himself but knowing that they have the upper hand and could possibly win the tournament as they failed in the third movie and Terry would have learned from those mistakes hopefully and not try and go to sudden death and just try and win the tournament. This will really strengthen Johnny and Daniel's bond knowing that they were both in Cobra Kai because Johnny doesn't know this and I think that when he finds out him and Daniel will just have more respect for each other. They both know that Cobra Kai has somewhat ruined their life and now they truly understand that they have to defeat Kreese in order for this to fully go. But we know Kreese isn't going to let go of that with the way he is but Terry is going to be a harder challenge. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I really, really can't wait to see how they introduce Johnny to Terry Silver because things are going to get wild in season four and they already did in season three. But of course, this series just keeps impressing and getting more insane. So guys, thanks for watching this video. Smash that subscribe button for more Cobra Kai content and comment down below 10K before March and let's try and smash that target. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next video.